Hey, welcome back to the uh, welcome back to the channel. We told you guys we would start vlogging our car stuff, right? Well, me and Nick are car dealers. We own our own business, but uh, we've been buying and selling cars. It's been really successful. Well, this is our recent purchase. We literally just bought it. We didn't really <laughs> pay attention to it, but uh, we bought it. It's a zero emissions Leaf. It's a uh, it's a good car. Um, it's just all like emissions, but this is like the kind of the process that we go through to buy cars. We bid on them, we win them, and then we go pick them up from Odessa. We didn't know we was buying an all electric car. Yeah, it's all electric. We thought it was gas. So I got in it because I have to like get out there, drive it to the, he's got the trailer. So I'm like driving it and I was like 12 miles uh, left. Well, good thing it's electric. And then like I'm pulling around, but it's all electric. So it's. Yeah, I was thinking it was hybrid. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, this is kind of the process. Me and Nick bid on cars. And we and like I said, we've been doing really good. We've been really successful with the cars that we've had and sold. And so yeah, we're hoping one day this will be like a full time job. Uh besides, you know, doing like YouTube and stuff. But uh but yeah, this is one of our new purchases. We're gonna clean it up, put it on the market for sale, and I will walk you guys through that process. And then this is zero emissions. I mean it's a clean car too. Besides the trash bag that I totally did not mean to open up and just show you guys. <laughs> Otherwise, it's a clean car. <laughs> There's a trash bag laying in there. But it's got like navigation. It's automatic. All electric. Uh, I mean, they're not worth a fortune. But, you know, we could probably make some money on it. But yeah, I'm going to help him unload this. And uh, we'll go from there. All right, like I said... We we bought this. We didn't like. I can hear it on, but there's just no noise. You know what I mean? It's got a backup beeper. You hear it? That's a parking brake. Can you hear the backup beeper? So like I said, we bought this thing. We didn't like read the description. So, come on. The brakes are really touchy too. You're on them. Stay straight. Straight, stay straight. <laughs> You're good. Yeah, come straight off. Gonna drive it down the road. Okay. Yeah, let's do it. It's got a backup camera, navigation, heated it's steering wheel. It down. Yeah, it does. It's got heated steering wheel, heated seats, AC. The cardboard box on it. That's what the trash bag's for. That Nick made a good. Uh, that's why I was there to keep the carpet clean. Cause it's a really clean car. And it's all electric. Be My careful. First, we only got 12 car. miles. Your first 11 miles, actually. Looks like you got a lot up there. But I think it's we're low on electricity. Which is weird to say. <laughs> so like I was saying, we, we bought this thing. We didn't read the description. But you can only get 100 miles out of this car. So, oops, <laughs> I guess, fun, I guess. Fun. Hey, I was uh, editing this video. Sorry, it's like one o'clock in the morning I'm editing, <laughs> editing a video. Uh, but I didn't want to say, I've noticed the, a couple times that I did say um, that we didn't read the description and stuff like that. We did read the description. I don't know why I was like saying that. But um, we did read the description. Like we knew the car was a good car, um, but we didn't know it was all electric. That's what I meant to say is uh, we thought it was like a hybrid. And that's why I kept saying that we didn't read the full description, but we did read the description because we, we did research on the car, 
because we do research on the cars before we buy them. And then, like, we go through, look at the damage, if there is any, and stuff like that. Because you can do, like, on Odessa, we usually only buy from Odessa because, like, one of the best places to buy in Alabama um, during, like, auction-wise. Um, so that's why we buy from there. But, um, yeah, it's, uh, we did read. We just didn't read where it was, like, only electric. We thought it was a hybrid car. That's why I keep saying that. So, yeah. <laughs> Zero emissions. <laughs> Zero emissions. <laughs> Secret road. But uh, we're gonna try, I guess that's why the value of the car is so low, but we got it for a good price. We, we should maybe make some money on it. But it's gotta go to somebody that's like not traveling, you know what I mean? So it'd be like somebody it's trying to get back. commute from work. Yeah, if somebody like Nick, home. because he's got like this, you know, big ass SUV that sucks gas and only gets like eight miles a gallon, he would drive this back and forth to work so he could afford to keep that truck. You know what I mean? So it had to be sold to somebody like that, I guess. Because you're not driving this to Birmingham, there's just no way. You'd have to charge it in Birmingham, I think. We're 10 down to 10 miles, dude. We got, we're gonna have to turn around. We're gonna have to turn around. <laughs> Where was you going, the gas station? <laughs> well, we went down the road and come back, and then we walked and crunched some numbers. And Nick would like actually benefit from keeping the car. Yeah, pay for itself. For it four would, months. yeah, four months. It would pay for itself just in the gas that Nick spends in this to go back and forth to work. It would pay for itself. So Nick is like heavily debating on keeping it as we speak. <laughs> so I had to record this. Yeah. I'm thinking about it. I'm gonna think about it over the weekend <laughs> as I'm shooting people in airsoft. <laughs> yeah. yeah, we are uh, going to Wargate. Um, we're, we're act I'm actually packed up in the car. We're taking my car and uh, we're fixing to pack up Nick's stuff and uh, we're going to Wargate. It's an event, it's a three day event down, uh, where it's a little past Chattanooga. I don't know the exact place it's at, but it's uh, right past Chattanooga from Petros. Petros? down in Petros. So we're going down there. We're going to shoot some people in Airsoft. We're a part of the Russian team. I've actually got a track suit. We're filming all this. I got my cameras and stuff. So it's going to be a fun time. As soon as we get back, Nick's going to have a new car. <laughs> what does suck, I will put, I will say this. We bid on this when we won it and then we bid on a Jeep and we won it, but the guys denied our offer because they wanted two times more than what the vehicle is actually worth. So you do run into stuff like that. I do want, like, that's why I wanted to make videos for the car lot so you could get a better understanding of what we go through when we buy cars. Is the, that's one thing we run into is people will deny our bids after we win cars because it's not what they wanted. And then sometimes the cars are worth, not worth what they're asking, like the bid they want or whatever. And so we can't buy them because, because of that reason. Like, we're not gonna make any money if we buy it and try to sell it. So, that's what sucks about it. Yeah, yeah. I would've got that one, Nick. That's all right. I'll that's put the pin in for you. <laughs> I ain't putting that pin in for you. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> Never mind, he's just gonna do it. <laughs> But this is kind of like what we do when we, uh, we're gonna make more videos obviously, but this is kind of what we do when we go and buy cars for from the sale to sell for the car lot. So, and this is where we do the car lot. This is Nick's house, this is shop. We just decided to have the car lot here because it's more, it'd be cheaper than buying a place, but eventually we want to buy a place in Coleman, so. And this is what it looks like when we use a Mustang to drive four hours for an airsoft event packed up but that is all from us car dealer video for this week i'll have another video of airsoft uh coming out soon as soon as we're done with this event but uh yeah peace